here in Nashville who lives in the Syl Sylvan Park area says that someone tried to steal his Kia. The next night he says that his neighbor's Hyundai was stolen and both men spoke to our Lydia Fielder. They say that they are shocked this happened in their very busy and friendly neighborhood. Monty Hicks walked out to his 2011 Kia Forte Saturday morning to find it broken into. Hey, I saw this part was sitting on the floor. And I thought, okay, that couldn't have just fell off like, you know, gotten loose. It's all torn up. My windshield wiper arm is broken off. So I'm like, somebody tried to steal this car. He says it was a rare occasion that he left it unlocked, but he says nothing was taken out of it. I have a lot of camera equipment because I have a podcast, and so all that stuff was still there. They just wanted the car. Now he's left wondering why it wasn't stolen. They got everything off, but they could have got spooked away. I don't know. Especially since the very next night, a Hyundai at his neighbor's house was stolen. I was just raising the blinds to, you know, let the morning light in. She saw shattered glass laying in the place where her aunt's 2018 Hyundai Tucson was parked just hours before. They called police. They said that it's usually kids that just want to joyride for a couple days and then they dump it somewhere. Both of these crimes track with what Metro detectives say has been a 410% rise, specifically in Hyundai and Kia thefts since last October, thanks to a viral social media trend this summer. Hyundais and Kias made from 2011 to 2022 are especially vulnerable. To help discourage thieves, Kia is offering these free steering wheel locks to people who own certain models. You just turn the wheel, turn off your car, and lock it into place. You can still start the car, but you can't steer it. But Monty says the lock is more of a hassle than a fix. You know, it's time consuming, and who, who does that? They want it, they'll do it. So for now, he's parking his Kia closer to the house off the street while he sorts out insurance to get the damage fixed. In Nashville, Lydia Fielder, WSNV4.